If distractions cost us time, then time management is pain management. Near all. We have an innate desire to escape discomfort. That's one of the main reasons why you're watching this YouTube video right now instead of doing what you should be doing. Distractions are just a way our brains deal with pain. It's painful to do actual work. It leaves us open to judgment and criticism from others that sometimes we just don't want to hear. But it's not all so black and dark. We can use this seemingly broken part of our brain and turn it into a superpower for good. And we have actually used this superpower for thousands of years already. Think about it. If satisfaction and pleasure were permanent, we wouldn't have advanced so much as a human race. If you were happy all the time, would you really want to work so hard for that dream vacation? Or would you just stay at home and be happy, not needing to go to work at all? If you want to learn how to deal with discomfort, you first need to accept that discomfort and dissatisfaction is normal and it happens to everyone. Discomfort and dissatisfaction are your brain's default state. You are wired to be a little bit dissatisfied. But you might be thinking, well, I'm happy when I play video games, or I'm happy when I watch Netflix, or I'm happy when I drink. But well, then I challenge you to only play video games, Netflix, booze, whatever, for a week. Sooner or later, you're gonna return to a default state of dissatisfaction. And this cruel concept is called hedonic adaptation. But now you know that you're just like everyone else. If we are not happy, that doesn't mean we are not normal. We are just human. So whenever you feel slight discomfort while doing the work your future self is going to be proud of, you just have to accept it and keep working. Adjust your seat, stretch out your hands, and keep going. And tell me right now in the comments, what task are you supposed to be doing right now? And what's the deadline on it? Also, this video has been heavily inspired by Nir Eyal's book, Indistractable. I would recommend it to anyone who gets distracted. The link will be in the description, so make sure to check it out. Hey Google, tell me a joke. What's the first thing a monster eats after he's had his teeth checked? The dentist.